Welcome back to another awesome video. This is the Elgato Key Light Neo. This is a light, I'm using it for two main things. One for uh, Teams. My current video conferencing light is really just a Craftsman work light that I have Velcroed to a tripod and you can't really look at it because it's got these bright LEDs. This has a nice little diffuser on the front and I can also use it to have some more control over illumination when I'm filming and stuff. Uh, it comes with the light and a detachable stand. It can be mounted on a monitor or on your laptop. It also comes with a USB extension and USB-C cable, which amounts to about eight feet of uh, cable between the power brick, which is not included, and the uh, light itself. It is a Wi-Fi light, but even without Wi-Fi, it's really simple to use. You got four buttons. You got your on-off button here. You got two presets, preset one and preset two. And you can control the, both the brightness and the color temperature with this knob by punching that and it'll switch modes and then you can change the temperature, punch it again, you can switch the brightness. And just like a car radio, once you get it like you want it, you can hold the preset for a little bit and that'll become that preset once it flashes. So that's pretty easy. If, if you don't do nothing else but pull it out of the box and just plug it in, that's what you get. It also has this nice little cord wrapping thing. Like I said, it can be rotated, it can be put on a tripod, mounted on a monitor. It also is Wi-Fi capable. So let's look at the app. You can control it with both a phone app and a computer app. So here's the app. So you can control, you can power it on and off and you can control the brightness and the temperature. Now, one thing that's interesting about the brightness, you'll notice right here, I'm stuck at 40%. I can't go any higher. That's because I'm just using a standard Apple power brick. Uh, we're gonna try it with a different brick here in a second, but you really need a three amp power supply according to the manual to make it get to full brightness. In addition to app control from the PC and the phone, it also has an API which somebody online has thoughtfully documented for us. So you can actually control this from Python code. Let's give that a try. So here we have a simple Python script. This is just a put request to the light. Go ahead and execute that and we can control the brightness. Uh, just go ahead and run it a couple times and change the brightness. So you can change the brightness and the color temperature with uh, a simple REST API, turn it on and off, that kind of thing. Pretty easy to do. Uh, yeah, just run that again. Okay, so yeah, cool, huh? Hmm, yes. <laughs> anyway, so we've got the Key Light Neo. Uh, is it Neo from the Matrix? Whoa. It's not Neo from the Matrix. It's a new line of products. And apparently the only difference is it comes in recyclable packaging and it's painted white, unlike their other products. Now really, it's supposed to be great tech made easy. So their whole theme is something that's easy for you to plug in. And like if you're a podcaster or even just doing video conferences. Is that a switchboard? That's a, uh, oh, what do you call that? That's a stream deck. So they have a stream deck, which can be programmed with these keys and control lights and podcasting and cameras. But that is, a, I guess, a light version, a Neo version, an easy version of it or something. But... Full disclosure, I got this for about $35 new. Retail right now, this is going for about $74 on Amazon. And considering it's basically just a Wi-Fi LED, it might not be worth it, but happened to stumble across this. So, so far, so good. Also, comment below if you want us to get like the microphone or the stream deck. Anyway, so that's just a quick little uh, thing about the, the Elgato Key Light Neo. So... We'll be back, and hopefully we'll be using this to help illuminate those cassette decks and future things. Uh, anyway, we'll talk to you later. See you next time for another awesome video.